So another day, another TKS game. Today we're on the good side of airport and we're going to be TKSing all over the place. So where is TKS strong? So he's 39Y. So basically it's all about, for, for us, it's going to be about the town battles and not so much the open. But we've got forward deployed and he doesn't because the Spetsraz Vedka went down to uh, recon forward deploy, which means we can get here. And uh, yeah, we're going to YOLO this into here. And then, uh, who knows? Yeah, let's just try that. So we can do some pretty zany forward deployed rushes with TKS. Uh, it's actually really quite strong. Um, so, yeah, we'll try that. And yeah, the, these buildings are now two buildings. Very exciting. Uh, the other place we can do a zany... I mean, we, we should get this, and then we can put Fliegerfaust in it, and basically all his planes will fly over this, just because of the way the map works. It's a bit odd. It's a bit odd. And, uh, yeah, we're going to try and get an AMX to here. And we should basically get Zulu. Uh, he won't really be able to contest us there. Not easily, simply because of the... The way the map works... Although they have changed this building, so now it's like t two buildings. But basically, you put an ATGM there, and he doesn't really—he's not really able to stop that. And um, is this is a new road that wasn't there before? So they have changed it because that's a nice new road. They still haven't connected this, but they've connected it there, which means I have even more of an advantage in getting into this zone. That's hilarious. So we'll get a couple guys there, 180, one not 80, and um, yeah, okay, right, that's weird, it's the way they've implemented these new buildings, they just don't seem to work properly, and so we're going to go for Zulu, we're gonna just going to forward deploy everything because I can, <laughs> whether or not it's a good idea remains to be seen. He'll probably get an ATGM in here, which will be difficult. And this is split as well. This used to be this whole segment. No, it's not. So we'll try and get somebody there. And to be honest, if we can get a Milan team there, that would be huge. And our stuff's just so cost efficient. I think this is a really strong division, actually. I really do. I think people have been sleeping on TKS. So we're going to try and get this guy to here. Could use like a... So perhaps a recoilless rifle team. What's the range? 1400. Yeah, I guess it can work. And we'll get like one green berets there. I'm trying to improve my speech. Not one like green berets. Just one green berets is fine. So we're doing a cool attack everywhere kind of strategy and we're gonna stop his helicopters by buying these one for each push and yes we will buy a cv i suppose air mobiles are pretty you know if i could get an air mobiles there that'd be great it really would and why wouldn't we just put this here because then it can shoot. Every, it can shoot the. Because uh, that's only showing its ground range. Its helicopter range is significantly higher. So yeah, we could put that there, and then we could put uh, air mobiles. And so it's either a CV or an air mobiles, basically. And to be honest, if I can get to here, which I don't actually think I can, <laughs> I think you'll get there quite quickly. Um, but we could definitely get to over here. Je vous écoute. So let's try that, and uh, thanks for waiting, and we'll do a cut here. Don't want to waste any of your time, because, you know, I'm just such a nice person and all. So he immediately said, good luck, have fun, and started as soon as I said thanks for waiting. Uh, and it's time to thank the generous channel joiners. They get the names on the screen. They're really helping me out. One channel join at the lowest level is worth 2,000 views. So if you're feeling bad about your ad block, you could subscribe for one month, get all those early access videos, get all those members exclusive videos, help the channel, get your name on the screen, and then you could cancel it. Or you could just forget about it and keep paying for it. 
<laughs> what? <laughs> anyway, uh, we'll see what happens here. I wish helicopters were less regarded, but, you know, we do what we can. Not sure where this guy's going. And we haven't encountered the enemy yet. There he is. There he is. So, will he unload in that building? Because if he does, then we should really try and get over here. Yeah, he is. He's just unloading in that building. So, we're going to try and bomb him. And these guys don't even have shock. Whereas these guys, oh, they don't have shock either. Oh, he's, he's running away. He's running away. Oh, where's he going? I hope I don't lose him. Yeah, he just went behind that building. No, no, he's not there anymore. He can, I can't bomb that. Well, we'll see if that hits him. <laughs> I don't think it will. Oh, no. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, never mind, we're dead. <laughs> Anyways, we took that, but we did lose that plane, which didn't really have to happen. That was, that was very uh, opportunistic, I suppose you could say. And this thing is just whiffing all its shots, because of course it is. Yikes, and now we've been spotted by that man there. We're actually going to just run away. Oh, but it fired anyway. Yeah, because he's dying. As you can see. So, that went really well. Apart from the fact that we lost that plane for no reason. Apart from our own lethargy. And we bought that CV, and now we're going to buy a CV for over here. My main concern is that cub. But, hey, we're doing alright for ourselves. We really are. I mean, look at all this. So now, because cause our stuff's so cost-efficient and he's playing 39Y, which is really not good in the early game, we've got a pretty significant advantage on him. This thing's still getting shot. No, he sees me! Ow! <laughs> there we go, we took him out. And now we're going to try and take out this building because we know there's a guy in there. Uh, so we'll send that to the. We need a, one of the helicopter ones, really. They're a lot faster, and uh, oh, we don't actually have a fob. Okay. I've been bringing a lot of fobs, but if you've not got MLRS, you probably don't need a fob. Okay, so we want to kill that, but the cub. I'm scared of the cub. And you will definitely rinse this. So we could try and get the Green Berets into this forest. If they could get there, that would actually be huge. Because then we can kill him. Because we get the Green Berets to stun him up, and then we bring in the AMX and just point blank him. And we should get him easily. So he's bringing a lot of tanks on that side. So we'll try and... Uh... I don't know how to fight it, really. Buy some Rowans in case he tries some air or something. Oh no! Oh, that's a shame. I really should have... I, re I should have just smoked that immediately, but I didn't notice. Well, we'll still get him, but now I'll lose my... Uh... Now I'll lose my... I've lost my thingy my bob. Oh no. If that misses, we don't get... Oh no! <laughs> that is That is certainly something. That is a really something moment. I am really somethinging over there. <laughs> Just didn't kill him. <laughs> but we, we we got four hits on him. <laughs> T80 moment right there. T80 moment. Oh no, but now we can't see him. There he is, there he is, there he is. Come on, please don't kill my whatever. Right, so now we need to find that cub with the LGBT. There it is. It one shots my guy. And, oh, thank goodness it missed that one. Great. And now we're going to try and get both his cubs. I think we got them both. <laughs> right, so that still worked out in the end. And now we're going to try and get this guy. <laughs> that's pretty funny. <laughs> but anyway, now it's a free fly zone. So that's good news. Um, we'll get some uh, Milans over here. Get a Milan over here. Where's that CV? Where's that CV? We just need these guys to be right on the edge of this so that they can all shoot that. Because, yeah, we... Yeah, okay, just all shoot it. And he's not got his smoke, so we should be Gucci. Gucci. Um, that guy might not make it. 
So we got him. And now we're gonna just... Okay. Oh no, I think I might have just whiffed that because I uh, right clicked to try and shoot the other one. My bad. So yeah, we're getting rinsed over there. But hey, he's not got any AA because we got it all. And sadly we've run out of rounds there because of my own stupidity, right? I mean, we would have got one more shot off on that. Maybe we would have hit it. But either way, he's got a back because he's just assuming that we've got more rounds than we actually do. So we're, we're zoning him. And we're going to buy this so we can start hitting some of those transports. And we're going to buy this so we can get in over here. Uh, not transport. So we can hit that supply. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to get. I need to get that. <laughs> Because he's going to start healing up that tank, and I'd rather he didn't, basically. <laughs> I should, probably should have gone for the tank instead, but whatever, who cares. So that's healed up. These guys should probably get over there. Hello. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, so he's actually still got some AA there. So, uh, oh yeah, we need to get that back. He's buying a lot of those. Lol. <laughs> Come on, move. Oh, it's a bit slow off the mark, that one. It gets out, though. At least it appears to. Right, so he, he is sort of taking this out. Um, we need some, uh, some like recoilless rifles, like a Milan. Um, it's not really accomplishing anything, but we need to drive it closer. And we'll try pushing over here. Like, what is that? Is that a bomber? It looks like it from the way he's flying. But it's not dropping his bombs. Right, so he just thought we were in there. No, what? He saw... <laughs> Damn. So he saw that somehow. <laughs> Wild. So we need to get back now. And figure out how we saw that. And try and do something about it. That guy's probably not going to make it. Oh man, we're just getting rinsed. Um, yeah, it's just these T-80s. We're having a tough time against these T-80s. Get a supply helo over there. Supply helo of it. Oh, actually, I think I already bought that. Yeah, I did. Get some close range tanks. A close range tank. <laughs> we should win that fight. But yeah, we lost that green berets because uh, this guy was just rinsing us. So we'll bring this out here and try and find that recon, wherever it may be. And we're going to try and move this guy up. Oh, actually, you can actually see it there. Because who knows where that is? Zikrung's over here. Whoa. So we're, we're trying to... Must have been a side shot because he was firing his ATGM towards this and then this must have side shot him. It's the only way I can see that happening, really. Try and hit this guy, perhaps. Just give me a target. Just need to immediately evac. Because I know there's a Strel around there, and also, yeah, he's got SUs. Thankfully, he doesn't clock on. Right, so we know he's in there. We know he's in there. Well, this was a salvo length 10. Right, well, we'll fire three salvos at him, and then presumably he's going to run away. Oh, oh, whoops. <laughs> Good job he didn't dive that. That's weird, actually. A bit, bit of a misplay from him. So I do wonder how he saw this. He, he might have seen it from, like, all the way back there or something. That's a shame. I'm not sure what killed that. But we are plus two. And, yeah, we know what his plan is. His plan is to uh, buy more T-80s. And we're out of... Well, we certainly have plenty of these. That should be sufficient. And, yeah, you see how long they take for their cohesion to get back. But they've changed all the colours, so, like, mediocre looks like it's actually bad now and stuff like that. It's just a bit, a bit silly. It's a bit silly. So, who knows what's still over here. 
Just tell these to follow those AMXs around. And now we can try and get this over to here. Although, something killed that. Let's just go and clear this out. Right. Where's that artillery piece? Corrected shot and we're not that far away. So that's going to absolutely delete him. Then you need to load back up. And yeah, we want to attack here, but we don't want to rush it. We don't want to rush it, and we don't have to rush it. So, get a couple of Flieger first. And a couple of Zikarungs. A Zikarungs. <laughs> this guy is not long for this world. Should probably get this back. Oh man, we missed him and then he's gonna move. Oh, and then we missed him again. That's a shame. So we'll hit that. So that's probably where he's going. <laughs> that's where I'd go. Yeah, look, uh, we can see him walking towards it. It's pretty funny, actually. So if we can get to that building, we got some pretty decent sightlines. Just sort of attacking everywhere because I feel like I might be slightly better than my opponent. Uh, that might be uh, self-aggrandizement though, maybe. We'll find out. Have to move these guys, we don't want them all in the same building. But yes, we want to attack Bravo. Oh, we could do some recon actually. Maybe a couple, one of those. He's got exceptional optics when he stood still. And we'll get this over to there. We don't have any AA on this side, so we have to, we do have to be careful. That VLRA-20 won't stop a bomber. Just hit that if you can. So yeah, he's going somewhere. Who knows? Who cares? I'm uh, Lois. I'm a Minecraft. <laughs> Uh oh. Oh, I should have moved this. Too greedy. Never mind, he's going for this. He's also hitting the wrong building. <laughs> Lois! I'm in Minecraft! Right, two rolls are over here. Although, to be honest, we want to be doing this attack. Like, whole wholeheartedly. That's coming in a Humvee, that's a shame. And yeah, he's aiming for the wrong building. It's pretty funny, actually. He's moved that. Lois! I'm in Minecraft! Oh, hello. So, trying to load this back up, but it appears to be bugged out. It does happen. Yeah, well, like I said, no AA on that side. <laughs> We should win this, although we are mediocre cohesion for some reason. Even though, I guess it's because we weren't in the building. But yes, the artillery is about to come in on for both teams on this. So when those last guys arrive, we'll uh, we'll do the attack. Lois, I'm in the building. He's still aiming for that. Lois. Oh, yikes. <laughs> That's what I get for lowest posting. Right. I'm going to flieger first out, and then how many Zikarungs have we got in here? One. Nice. And yellow cohesion is high, which is just dumb. It just doesn't make any sense. It's already moved. Right, do you see what I mean? They keep moving. It's kind of. Oh, no, he's going for this now. It keeps missing. It's kind of weird. Oh, hello. There was actually just a guy in here. But that's a shame because we might lose that Flieger first. There was literally just a guy in here. So we've seen this all... No, he's not because of where he's put it. He's because of where he's put it, right? He didn't actually see any of that. He had it here, so he doesn't even know. That's pretty funny. Anyway, we need to buy some AA, AA planes. Considering what's about to happen. Anyways, Lois, I'm in Minecraft. 
Right, got the P4 Milan's out here. The Roland out here. It's out there. Right, Lois, it's Minecraft time. Uh, we know there's a Strella back there, which is obviously not great, so we'll get these out. Oh no! Oh, that's a shame. I'm not sure he would even hit that. Right, so we, we need to deal with that before we uh, <laughs> we can't see it again. It's a big problem. So there's somebody in one of those buildings. Okay. Oh no, he's got... He's bought his last cup. Right, that's a big problem. <laughs> oh man, I meant to press this, but I've, I've just missed, I guess, because I'm regarded. Uh... We hit that Strella. Go, go time. Got one Roland. Yeah, losing all my AA was not ideal. Tell you the truth. And he went for the, the Jets. Uh, he's got a lot of planes. He's got a lot of planes. Blimey. There's a lot of planes there. Anyways, we got all the AA, which is sort of the, sort of the idea. These guys are out of rounds. And our helicopters are all getting in because um, you know because of how we prioritized our targets and so on there but hey we lost a lot there that we didn't really have to lose so that was a uh, big oof big oofs all around and uh, yeah we're just gonna <laughs> jump in these buildings and uh, <laughs> put that over to there put this over to there we need a, a that's a big nice big juicy he blob there but he's, what's he going for? He's probably going to hit some guys. Might hit the supply. Yeah, he gets three. He gets three. Try and get that LGB. He's going for the Roland, perhaps. Yes, it is. I don't think we got... We did get him. The Roland avenged itself. Or at least he avenged himself. Because he got the ro uh, You know, the enemy avenged himself. Because he got the Roland. So this is going pretty well. Uh, the air mobiles are all routing though, which is kind of annoying. Um, right. So that went pretty well. Now we'll start buying Zikarungs for over here. So we got those two, and now we're in here. Easy peasy. Um, so that went pretty well. I know I've been saying that a lot, but it did. So, get all these over to here. And that's our zone now. Uh, he does have a cub round there somewhere, because I saw it shoot, but it must be out of ammo, because it's not shooting at me. Right. So, we know there's somebody in here, because we saw him shoot before. Um, so we need, uh, need some, like, P-Farm lines over here or something. Uh, yeah, I think that worked out. This guy's out of rounds. I'll we'll send these over to here. Okay, so we can send these darts to the lawn mowers to go mow that lawn. And, oh no, his, his planes are back up. So it's it's kind of hard to do TKS air spam when the enemy has this many planes. And we won't win those fights at all, we definitely won't. So yeah, he's playing air spam 39th, which is, is weird to tell you the truth, but it does happen. Okay, so we want that zone. More of an ego thing, don't really need it. But he's not going for the helicopters, which is, uh, in my opinion, a mistake. So he's sending stuff over there, interesting. Hmm, interesting. And, oh, we lost, oh, yikes. That's a juicy attack, isn't it? Uh, especially given our lack of AA. We've got, like, what, one Flieger Faust? Been relying on our planes, but obviously the planes just got killed by his planes. But I, I'm pretty sure he evac'd his planes. I mean, we'll find out. We'll find out. <laughs> so we'll buy uh, buy some additional AA for over here, I suppose, because it seems we need it. Man, just get in the building. 
He's routed. Oh, they're still up. Oh, that's a big mistake. Oh, big mistake from the Hippler. Big mistake from the Hippler there. I might lose this. Oof. That was close. Uh, yeah. We just can't deal with his... You know, he, he's dealt with our air spam very, very well. Very, very, very well. He's done a good, great job with that. Um, by by buying all those planes, he's, uh, he's really messed us up. Um, yeah, we're struggling to deal with these things. I mean, we need that figure first. We need some ammo, perhaps. And yeah, we'll try and uh, we'll tr just triple shoot this. I mean, we'll see how it goes. Oh, he bailed out. That's bad news for him. But I mean, there are four, so he, he wouldn't he wouldn't be able to deal with this anyway. Um, the the main question, of course, is that thing, <laughs> which can kill all this, and his planes are probably still up. Buy another one of these and start sending these guys forwards. Just give them buildings to go to. Don't want them caught out in the open. These guys have healed back up as well, so we can send them forwards. Move this. And yes, that's got ammo now, which means it will slowly start dealing with this. And if he gets too close, then then other things will happen, like uh, uh oh, <laughs> oh, there we go, like that. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's not ideal. <laughs> He's got quite a few things over there. League of Oh, no. That's a shame. <laughs> and, yeah, I don't know. We need to move these up. Right, well, I'm going to just start smoking this because he keeps hitting me with that and I can't really deal with it. Well, maybe we should stop smoking it, because now we've got ATGM superiority. Well, oh well. <laughs> it's happened. And, yeah, we've got lots of points left, so let's uh, start YOLOing some guys in here. Whoa. There's one. I'm trying to get to him. It's kind of hard. Oh, that's a cluster. It's going for these. I sh should have brought some more AT inf because the Zikrings don't actually have AT. So they're going to get to this tank and they're not actually going to be able to accomplish anything. Has he still got... No, he's... So... Oh, the Strela hit us and we evoked. That's a shame. Uh-oh. This was a bad clumping. An unfortunate clumping of men. I think we might lose everybody there. Oh, never mind. We only lost two. Casualties mean nothing to the Soviet... Uh, I mean... Uh... <laughs> There's no identity, really. There's no pact versus NATO identity. NATO's got spam divisions. Pact's got spam divisions. NATO's got heavy tank divisions. Pact's got heavy tank divisions, etc., etc. I think it's a shame, to tell you the truth. But hey, they don't put me in charge. Even though I have saved one. Right, so the main concern I have is that Strela is probably still out there. Yeah. Try and land on top of him, maybe. Uh, I, you can probably kill, kill us before we even get on him. Alright, GG. Well, unless that hits. We should hit. <laughs> Um, oh, he's, he's just playing it out. You too. That was nice of him. Maybe he knows who I am. But yeah, I'm a small time YouTuber, you may have heard of me. Although, of course, you know. He's played five games this season, but he's had four defeats. Whereas I've played 14 games this season, and I've had two defeats. So I'm ranked 14th, but when I wake up tomorrow, I won't be. It's because uh, <laughs> they've reset the ladder, right? So things are happening. Anyway, time to sleep. I'll see you around. GG. Oh, I didn't check the kill list.